Margaret Hutchison Rousseau Margaret Hutchison Rousseau was a chemical engineer. She helped design the first commercial plant that made penicillin on a massive scale. She was born in Houston, Texas. She earned her bachelor's degree from Rice Institute in 1932. She then moved across the country to attend Relate School at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology. In 1945, she became the first female member of the American Institute of Chemical Engineers. She earned the highest award of this institute in 1983 and remains the only woman ever to have done so. Rousseau was also interested in the arts. She was an amateur artist herself and when she retired in 1961, she became an overseer of the Boston Symphony Orchestra. She died in 2000 at the age of 89. As a young chemical engineer, she worked on two historically important projects. But during World War II, she helped design processes for producing high octane gasoline, which was a new invention when he started work. During World War II, U.S. oil companies rushed to design and build refineries for making high-octane gasoline to be used in military aircraft. In her other project, she played an important part in designing the first plan for making penicillin the first widely used antibiotic drug. Oil and petrochemicals were also an important part of Rousseau's career. In the 1950s, she helped develop the better ways of distilling crude oil. Crude oil is a mixture of many substances and distillation is a method used to separate them. Rousseau's helped invent a device called a ripet tried that improved the distillation of petroleum. She worked in two historically important projects. Both during World War II, she helped design processes for producing high octane gasoline, which was an invention when she started work. She played an important part in design the, fire, the first plan of making penicillin in the 1950s. She helped develop better ways of distilling crude oil, Rousseau helped invent a device called a ripple dry that improved the distillation of petroleum. Margaret was important because she invented submerged fermentation that helped reduce the space and work requirements for obtaining penicillin. She helped invent a device called a tray, improved the distillation of petroleum. She became the first female member of the American Institute of Chemical Engineers. Also, she earned the heights over of this Institute in 1983. I admire Margaret Hutchison because she invented 
the large scale penicillin manufacturing process. This medicine was more accessible for low income people. I would like to become like her any day.